Oh wow, that is tiny, was my initial thought. When I first saw the Olaplex number no. 7 bonding oil, we will review today. I mean, it is not that I've ever finished a hair oil, but somehow, if I pay a certain amount of money, I expect something, well, bigger. So now, after seven months of using continuously, do I think it is worth purchasing? Let's find out. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Dr. Anne, a physician passionate about skincare and, well, aging. A highly concentrated, weightless, reparative styling oil dramatically increases shine, softness, and color vibrancy. Number 7 minimizes flyaways and frizz while providing UV heat protection of up to 450 degrees Fahrenheit or 232 degrees Celsius. It is an oil, no texture surprises here, but a lightweight one. When rubbed into the hands, there is no greasy film, and unless you use too much of it, it doesn't add grease to the hair either. The scent is the typical slightly floral Olaplex scent, but very faint. I do not smell it on my hair after application. You can use it both on damp hair and after styling for extra shine and to smooth frizz. My preferred way is using it on damp hair before I blow dry or hairstyle, that way I don't need a separate heat protectant. I put two drops in the palms of my hand, run it through the lengths from the ears downwards and then whatever is left on my crown. When used after styling it works fine at smoothing the hair, but I don't see a difference to any other much cheaper hair oil I have used in the past. Other than the bisaminopropyl diglucol dimaleate Olaplex signature ingredient that I talk about more here, you will find dimethicone and several different oils like corn, sunflower, pomegranate and moringa seed oil. Interestingly enough, there is also ethyl hexyl methoxycinamate aka octinoxate, a UVB absorbing sunscreen. But while UV protection for the hair is important, I wouldn't expect too much effect here as you a only use a tiny amount and B, it is a very unstable without other stabilizing filters. There is also fragrance including limonene, citralinalol and citronellol. Now back to the initial question, is it worth purchasing? For me, absolutely. Not because it is the best hair oil I have ever used, I have used drugstore ones that gave a similar effect, and not because of the bisaminopropyl dimaleate either, although I have stated before that I attribute the health of my fine bleached hair to the discovery of the Olaplex in salon treatment. What makes the bonding oil worth repurchasing is the fact that I can use it both to combat fruits and as a heat protectant. I don't need to spend money on a separate product, take an additional step, and very important to me, I don't feel product buildup in my lengths, something I am very peculiar about. And if you take a look at how much I have left after using it for seven months, at least twice, usually three times a week, you will realize that it is indeed good value for many. If there is anything you would like to add, please do so in the comments below. I will link to more videos on the screen now that you might find interesting, and add links to my Instagram, blog, and Patreon account in the description box. See you soon. Bye.